This is Scott from ExperiencePoints.net. And George from ExperiencePoints.net. We have navigated the most complex puzzle. <laughs> we <had laughs> called the settings menu. Here we are again. Uh, what were, sorry, what were you saying? Okay, let's, okay. let's play it. Let's play, okay. let's, let's play the game. Playing, oh, what's this game we're playing? This game is called Spelunky. Oh. Hmm. We haven't played in a while. I don't think I like this game. Uh, oh, man. We got our set and a racist guy again. Wait, hold on. I'm... Doing some technical. Oh, you gotta move the screen. Yeah. Here we go. All right. Technical troubleshooting. Okay, that's better. All right. Can you guess? Can you? Okay. So I have a conversation to have for today. It's only gonna. I think it's gonna be short because I think it's already the dead horse has been beaten. Is it Peter Molyneux? It is fucking <laughs> Peter Molyneux. I just want to say, in no uncertain terms, uh -huh. I fucking told you so. I never debated this. Oh no, I know that. Like, I'm not saying yeah. you. But I'm just saying like. I remember when we had a conversation about the cube game or whatever, uh -huh. right? Curiosity. Curiosity. Uh -huh. And it was like, oh, you know, do you think this is going to change that kid's life? And I was like, I call fucking bullshit <laughs> right now. Like, literally, I'm really tempted. If I, if I can, in time, I'm going to find go the audio. Yeah. I'm going to cut it, and I'm going to splice it into this fucking YouTube video <laughs> right now. Um, I then, I read the Rock, Paper, Shotgun post after that. Did you read this? The, it was the, one of the interviews? Yeah, so John Walker opened up a uh, an interview with Molyneux just recently, like a few days ago, and asked him as the first question, are, are you a pathological liar? Oh my god, yes. It was a very dramatic interview. Kind of douchey. What did, uh... What did, uh... Punk he was like, no! <laughs> but mean, a yes. pathological liar would tell you that too. <laughs> That's the thing, is you can't actually ask that question and expect a good answer, because a pathological liar... Yeah, I mean, I guess maybe if you've been diagnosed or You something. have to trick them, you have yeah. to say, are you not, not, not a pathological liar? <laughs> a logical... Yeah, I mean, I get it, but there is this undercurrent... So here's the thing. You know Peter Molyneux is going to over-promise and under-deliver. Like, yeah. that's not... That's not in no question. No one's surprised. Yeah. yeah. No one should be surprised. So I don't really see Rock, Paper, Shotgun doing like a hardball interview with him as like a necessarily noble thing. It just seems kind of like a sad thing, you know? Like but it just kind of... The issue, I think, is a lot of people think that Peter Molyneux overpromises because he's deliriously joyful and optimistic. Yeah. When I think what the suggestion is, no, in fact, you're exploitative and unethical. Who's he exploiting? The public, maybe? But that's what that's what I'm saying. Like he's not. I mean, what about this? Like he's not a politician. He's not. You well, what know... about this? Like who's that Henderson guy? The yeah. one who wrote, who won the Cubes game, yeah. right? I think that there's a legitimate reason to believe that he knew. That should we this... kill this guy or should we leave him? Uh, we're doing pretty well. Oh, okay, we won't. Kill but him. do you want to grab a cape or something or the gloves? Like those are. We probably can't afford the cape. Yeah. Let's fucking kill him. Yeah. Nah, nah, nah. We, we don't want to kill him yet because he doesn't have a lot of bombs. You were saying, did he or did he not exploit Henderson? Right. And the so the okay, I'll, I'll bomb him. Yeah. Uh. All right. The the question at hand, right, is like, I think there's a legitimate reason to believe that Peter Molyneux knew that this kid wasn't going to be that involved in the process, and and over hyped the value of winning the contest uh -huh. so that people would play more cubes and uh -huh. it would get more press buzz. Mm. Like, I think that's, I think, maybe that's not the case, but yeah. I think that there's a reason to believe that it is a po it is it a, is a real possible, possibility. Yeah. Oh, this is great. Look, yeah. this cube so right easy, here. wow. So easy, even an, even an <laughs> idiot can do it. Uh, I'll just I think you're right good, now, actually, yeah. yeah. Uh, I'll hang on up here just to collect yeah, some just stuff. Yeah, some stuff. Ooh. Actually, we should well, be careful about this. Uh, I would have to get up, otherwise I'll die. Yeah. But we can do it, and with the safety of knowing that we're not going to. Yeah. So let's just spend a rope and get, and you climb back up. Okay. Let me. Uh, I'm gonna trigger this thing. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. Um. I don't know. What do you think? Do you think he? I mean, I think. I think Peter Molyneux is legitimately delusional. <laughs> like, I mean, I don't mean this sure. in like a mean way. I just think he actually doesn't doesn't have a lot of self awareness. But at the same time, I feel like all of this really reeks of like a gross consumerist mindset, where it's like this person lied to us, and we want to pay money for something that we're not going to be able to pay money for anymore. And it's like, 
are you really that invested in this thing? Like we and, cannot drop down because we won't be able to get back. That's up. true. Let's go around to so the right. Let's go around and then work. Like, are down. you really that like invested and entitled in this thing that we never will... existed and probably okay, we'll like? We just need to go to the exit. Yeah. Uh, if you look up. Ah, uh, you're right. I'll, I can. I thought I, I can might, just do it. I thought I might be able. To no, do we don't both uh -oh. need to do it. Look up. Just come over and look up. Look up. Okay. I just think there's like this hard-hitting journalistic aspect where it's like, guys, you know this guy doesn't know how to run a video game business. Like, he's a good ideas guy. Is this really a surprise? And do you, are you really... So you don't think there's anything... I, I just think that there's a... there's. I think it's legitimate to question whether or not he's been malicious in his... I think that's fine, but I don't think there's any we should not steal evidence that. of that. I mean, maybe we should steal that because like we already got the... Well, there might be a shopkeeper that'll get hit by it. Yeah, I guess that's true. Uh, I mean, especially with, like, a Kickstarter, whoa, uh, there's just so little money riding on this, like, I just feel like there are much bigger fish to fry. I mean, I'm far less interested in the Kickstarter than I am with the Cubes experience. Yeah. I just, I don't know, it just seems, like, very materialistic in a, in a kind of way where you're focused on this thing that doesn't really matter that much go, go kill it, go. and you're not doing a oh, lot of hard-hitting journalism nice nice throw I'm, i still got it <laughs> like so what if peter molyneux doesn't live up to his expectations of what he said like you know isn't are we really do we really need to be that paternalistic that we need to protect people by like outing like what a douchebag Peter Molyneux is. Like, I feel like people should, you know, people should be able to spend their money the way they want to spend their money, and and you don't. We don't need to have this huge conversation every time some guy who continues to fail on his promises fails on another promise. I don't know. I just. Uh, I'm not trying to. You need to drop that rock because there's the. Yeah. Oh, I think we're probably over we the do distance. This. Yeah. Actually, you know what? If I throw this up, maybe I can. Uh, there we go. Okay, cool. You know. Well, hold on. Let me let me get the sticky stuff. Are we surprised? No. I mean, no, we're not surprised. But again, are we like, entitled I... to anything? I don't think so. Like, I just don't. I find myself having a hard time getting worked up by it. Yeah. And it makes me feel kind of gross to see someone who I don't think can actually defend himself very well get kind of treated rudely you know i just think that there is a chance right that he got went into he goes into these processes without necessarily looking to complete it yeah you know? like can you imagine a scenario where peter mullen you get some sort of sick joy out of <laughs> out of like making these promises <laughs> and then not delivering like you know they're real pe like there that's are people, my fetish but he moves on to another game right yeah. like what does it mean for the people still working on the game, right? Yeah. Like, there's that story of one of the project leads now mm -hmm. is a guy who was just a fan of Goddess yeah. and is now, like, managing it and probably shouldn't be managing it and can't get anything done. And it's like, are you accurately... I'm not even super concerned about whether or not you're telling consumers the truth, but are mm -hmm. you telling your own workforce the truth? Are you telling people who are actually involved, like, yes, yeah. we can realistically get this done, or no, we can't? Because at some point, sure, maybe you didn't intentionally do it, but you need to stop doing it because people are going... To either lose their jobs or, you know, yeah, a slew of other... I, I am much more sympathetic to that. Uh, I'm also... If you leave your job to join a Kickstarter software development project, <laughs> you should kind of know what you're getting into. <laughs> like, buyer beware yeah, when it comes to... Yeah, I mean, to, uh, like, yeah. if you wanted a nice, safe job, go work for a university or go work for a big corporation or something. Would one be enough? Um, I think one might be enough. Oh, not quite. One is never enough. Well, at least we can blow it up anyway. I'll, I'll use one. Okay. Oh, no, 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 because you have only one left. Oh, I guess you're right. Okay. Ooh. Very nice. Oh, shit. <laughs> I hurt myself with a rock. I don't know. I'm not at all surprised about this. Like, even a little bit. 
but it is kind of a weird so interview d- tone. Did you read the interview though, where he's like, "I'm not gonna do any more interviews," and then at the end, the reveal is like he's actually done like a bunch of interviews. Yeah, that was part of it. Like, and John Walker did a good job of just basically like calling out Peter Molyneux as a person that doesn't uh, really know how to this. handle his life very well. Yeah. Uh, take the take the lady. Get rid of that spider. But it just made me more sad because it really doesn't feel like this guy can handle his life very well. Yeah. Like he, this this person needs help more than anything, and yeah. it just feels like you're kind of. I don't. Uh, maybe he is malicious. Maybe he's like some mastermind who like I mean, wants to ruin people's lives. I don't lives think it's one... a huge plan, but I think if he has a history, it's not just the public, right? Like again, if he has a history of misleading uh, people, like then this is like a public service. And maybe basically. yeah, and maybe I'm just like more sensitive because I read that like Kotaku series of posts that are like stories of me being fired, and yeah. they're like super depressing. Yeah. Ooh. Oh. Heard the... Uh, you think it's up or down? Probably, probably down. down. Well, hold on. Let's see if I can go up here. Hmm. It could be to the right. You never know. Well, either way, let's uh, kill that guy. And then... Shoot. We only have three bombs. Uh, let's take a good hard look. Hmm. I think it might be up. So what oh, if we... it could be right here. Yeah, that's what I was To thinking. the right of the blue gem. Careful, there's some spikes. Yeah. Oh, wait, hold on. You just got... Now it's it's going more, so you're probably right. Okay. Why don't we just put a bomb there on that branch, and okay. then I'll go over here. Oh, oh fuck Jesus. me. Okay. What happened? Oh, I oh. pressed down and accidentally okay. hit A. Well, we did it. Yeah. Scott, we did it. We did it. <laughs> God damn it. So the question is... Should we keep looking? Uh, uh, we... Hey, you have plenty of rope. I do. You could get back. But I, I don't I just don't see the value though. Like what are you gonna find out here? Maybe some bombs? Because bombs would be nice. Okay. Cause if we don't have bombs, it's really hard to steal oh, from all those shot thieves. A gem. Oh look, we found all of Peter Molyneux's broken promises. <laughs> They're just right here, guys. On the black market. <laughs> Actually, you know, we have enough money to buy bombs and then use those bombs to attack people. So let's just go up. Or buy a shotgun and use that shotgun to attack me. I'm a ghostess. But you can't fuck this up. No, I cannot. Well, I definitely can, but I should not. Alright, uh, here we not go. Enough bombs. Yeah, but I can buy a bunch of them. Okay. Let's see if there's a gun that I could buy. That would be even easier. Nope. Uh, not no. yet. Okay, I'm just gonna buy this stuff. You could probably get more than one. Yeah. I got eight, and then get this one, and then, and then I'm ready to blow this guy. This. <laughs> <laughs> so, do I have sticky bombs? You do. Okay. Oh jeez. Yes, they're fighting each other. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, Ooh, nice. nice! I got both their shotguns. Okay, I think they're gone. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, they picked up an ice beam. Okay, so we gotta be careful. That guy definitely has a weapon. Now I'll go over here for the Do you think that Peter Molyneux will ever be able to have the, the, the press's favor again? Probably not. <laughs> Especially well, after we want this guy to, to this whole time. Can... Oh, yeah. yeah. Nice! Yes! Oh, shoot. Wow. One more? Yeah, one more. Oh, oh God. Come on. Wow, he's getting up way faster now. There we go. Nice. Owned. Pro ghost. Pro ghost. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Did I or did I not say I am the ghostest or the mostest? <laughs> Whoa! That amateur ghosting, I think, is what happened. I so I knocked him, uh-huh. and then the spikes, look at how close I have to the onk. The, oh my, it's like rubbing in your face. The spikes. Okay, so I knocked him, and while he was in the air, the spikes came out, mm. which then knocked him up into the wall, which then bounced him over to you. God, that is classic Spelunky. <laughs> that, right there. that is classic Spelunky. Ugh. Let's do a couple quick runs, right. and then we'll call it. We'll call it a day. 
<sighs> Only running. Whoa, <laughs> we went the wrong direction. <laughs> Speed run. Yeah. I don't know if he'll ever... I mean, he's he has said, oh, I'm never going to do interviews again, blah, blah, blah. And it's like, okay, fine, don't do interviews again. Just yeah. stop. But he can't even stop, right? Like, I just think that he is... He's just compulsive, you know? And maybe he is a pathological liar in the most clinical sense. Uh, <laughs> we're fine, we're fine. Wait, hold on, hold on. Look, up, look, up, look up. Okay, fine, just go. Go, 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 go. <laughs> There's, like, probably a thing over here. Oh, I broke a box. Speed run. <laughs> we gotta, I mean, we gotta hit that guy's, uh... His number one... What was the number one spunky run? It was, like, less... Oh, God, I'm dead. <laughs> okay, well, thank God. I'm still... Wait, where are the spikes? Fuck it, speed run. <laughs> oh, oh, fuck! <laughs> <laughs> Both of us, if you just pan the camera over a little bit, there's another dead person. Oh, knife. dude, now I can just knife people on yeah. my way down. Speed oh, knife. Dude. Speed <laughs> Speed stab. I really like when I see the speed tree middleware in the games that I'm playing. Whoa, what is speed tree? What? It uh, it creates foliage. Like, it's a, middle, it's that. a middleware for uh, making trees in video games. Oh, right. It's called speed tree. <laughs> <laughs> There's so much middleware in video games. It's I know. Of, it's always weird what watching the credits. What's really weird is they never update their logos. <laughs> oh yeah. Like, Why, like Bink oh, Video has been that way yeah, since like, it's like 2001. Yeah, it's like a hideous logo. Like, yeah. Seriously, man. Like. Okay, oh shit. Okay. Hold on, okay. Hold on. I okay, can kill him. Kill him. I died. <laughs> oh shit! What happened? Oh, he shot. He shot. Uh, and I, he's what? Not, he wasn't uh, dead until just then. <laughs> ooh, that was good. Um, yeah. Uh, you know, that's the thing that I liked so much about Captain Toad, where you turned on the game, and there wasn't even, like, a cre There wasn't even a copyright scene. Yeah. It launched directly into the first level yep. with nothing. Like, you just started playing. Yeah. I don't think you can do that unless you are a first-party developer making a first-party game on the system. Like, I don't think that would pass cert. Yeah, you're probably right. You know? Whoa. Whoa. Pro dodge. Careful. Whoa. There you go. Pro doge. What's up, doge? Are we speed running or are we just legit running now? Because I feel like... Well, I, I mean, I think we're just, like, trying to do well but fast. Oh, I was about to shoot off. Oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. Well, you were fast about it. Yeah. Uh, can I blow this up? Yes, I can. Oh, nice. Wait. I wonder where the other thing is. Oh, my body. <laughs> Oh no, there was a. Oh, okay, no, we're fine. There was a gun. But it's still there. Should I carry that thing? Uh, probably. I have a shotgun. Yeah, but you can go back and get your shotgun. I thought we were speedrunning this shit. Yeah, I guess you're right. Well, I mean, I'm the ghost, so I'm just hanging out. Did we ever figure out what the mechanical significance of the flip is? Fuck. Uh oh. Bats! Oh. Save me from the bats, Scott! What are you doing? <laughs> you aren't fucking bad, dude. I'm blowing these bats! Oh my god. <laughs> oh shit, it's in the rocks. Okay, so. Oh man, here we go. Yeah. Oh jeez, here we go. Fuck. Oh, he has his gun. Oh! Oh, <laughs> oh my god, that was terrifying. <laughs> I redeemed myself from, from the bat debacle. You did? <laughs> yeah. I still feel like you failed on the on your bat duty, but that's okay. Bat duty. Are you serious? What is going on? <laughs> I don't want to have to bow a rope. I only have two rope. Hold on. No, 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 no. I can... Can you? Well, maybe. Yeah. Maybe. You can jump all the way up. <laughs> Take the long way around. Oh, oh earned! I have to, <laughs> I have to save those ropes. <laughs> Waste not, want not for the ropes. <laughs> Man, we didn't even get to the ice level. <laughs> there's, a, there's a dude down there. Hold on, I'm gonna blow him. Oh, jeez. Oh, no. We're dead. Do it. We're, We're dead. dead. We're dead. Oh, look, there's there your was, corpse. Yeah. One more? One more speed run. Okay. Ah! What would Peter Mullen oh, do? Fuck. Fuck you, I'm, I'm out. What would Peter Mullen do in what? If he was in Spelunky? If he was in a dungeon? Don't go that, don't go that way. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Is... You stop making games now, huh, Peter? <laughs> like, do you think he still plays games? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sure he ever played a video game. 
I mean, it's just so sad because he's made populous, you know? Like, he, he's yeah, made... Yeah, but I mean, he made populous like 20 years ago. Yeah, but what have I made? <laughs> like a, a, That's a very good point. A sick Excel spreadsheet? Yeah, but, but like... more importantly, you haven't promised anything. So... <laughs> Keeping expectations low. <laughs> I mean, that's the secret to your success. This Excel <laughs> spreadsheet will make you cry. You know what I haven't done? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Alright, I'm on bat duty. Keeping it up. Oh, <laughs> fuck. Scott. Bat duty. Oh, you know what? I actually can't affect bats. <laughs> Maybe it wasn't your fault after all. I'll get this trick to the exit for you. Nah, I got it. Oh, there's a dude. Go kill him. Take a shot. Have we already... No, okay. I mean, I'm... Whoa, no. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no, no. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, God. <laughs> Oh, Jesus. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, you a ghost in Oh, fuck. Oh, God <laughs> damn it. <laughs> God. Oh, I fucking hate Spelunky. Oh, Thanks, everybody. Oh, God damn it. Let's just throw some woodland creatures for a minute. Oh. Take off our rage. Let's play basketball, woodland creature. Okay. <gasps> nice. <laughs> the All-Star game's happening now. Oh, damn it. Come on. Oh, throw me. Oh, oh damn. Let's throw, what is this guy's name? Lewis? <laughs> His name's Tunnel Man. Is it? Yeah. Oh, oh Tunnel oh, Man. Damn. I don't know if you can throw him. Michael Jordan could. Kobe. Oh, <laughs> damn it. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> oh, so close. So it's got to be like right about here. Oops. What else? <laughs> was, that was that a pass? That was a uh, Shaq's free throw. Will, uh, will there ever be a Spelunky too? I don't know. I mean, how do you improve on this? Oh, how do you God. improve on this perfection? <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, I was gonna try to throw the thing, thing while on. you throw me. Oh, oh, I don't think you can. I don't think he, you can get in. His hold throw on, hold is on, too on. epic. Do you think that it's possible for me to grab him though? Okay, okay, when he's here close we go. Enough. Oh, <laughs> here we go. Or you can at least whip him. Okay, okay. Hold on, let me try it from here. <laughs> oh, I feel like you could have gotten in. Okay. All right. Well, no. Nope. Brick. Yeah. Try to okay. throw him from there. Nope. Airball. Get good. What Get is <laughs> what uh, I don't think I can pick him up. I don't up think we can do it. Yeah. Damn it. How come there's no poly How come there's no like thousand word polygon <laughs> article <laughs> about spunky no, basketball? No, no. <laughs> <laughs> yes! Yes! <laughs> yes! <laughs> I'm the greatest <laughs> Spelunky basketball player. <laughs> Everyone, <laughs> I have officially retired from Spelunky basketball. <laughs> wow. We will never. <laughs> Got it on tape. We got it on tape, everybody. Got it. <laughs> <laughs> Pro Spelunky right there. Oh, man. <laughs> MJ. Yeah. Evo next to you. <laughs> Evo 2015 coming at you. Watch the throne. <laughs> If you come with the king, you best come correct. Oh my god. Oh, thanks everyone. Experiencepoints.net is the website. Right. <laughs> See ya.